What we have to do today is say to ourselves, do we want the taxpayer to be able to pay precisely what we told them they would be paying in September, but with the assurance that that money is going to go to things that are under our control? What passing this motion today would allow us to do is have less buck passing and really be able to say we are responsible to you as the taxpayer. This is a decision that we are taking with our eyes wide open. And again, I must emphasize, I would not support this if it went to the operating budget. But because this is going to support things that we are normally begging other levels of government to pay for, I think this is entirely legitimate. Because we can then stand in front of the taxpayer ourselves and say, we're taking this from you and this is what you're getting in return. Citizens have lost the relationship between the taxes they pay and the services they receive. So I think that's the right thing to do. I think it's something that I personally have been pushing for. Right? This is what we do. And the fact that we've now been given the opportunity by one of these levels of government to fund these, pro to fund these programs, which is precisely what I've been begging for and we've all been begging for for so long, it would be foolish for us, I think, not to give up on this. I would like to hear from the public. I really want to know from the public what their priorities are and where they think this money ought to be spent. That's why I didn't like presupposing that some of it goes to the central library and so on. I think that this motion is a very nice compromise. After all that debate, I think we've gotten somewhere that I can really get behind and I urge council to get behind it as well.